So Dominic, you had requested a video showing how to set up your own Google account, so this one's for you, bud. Um, you're going to start off by simply going to google.com. When you're already signed in, these things disappear. Now you have a choice. You can go through Gmail and set it up, or you can hit sign in. When I hit sign in, at the bottom it's going to give me the option for create an account. This particular video I am filming in what's called an incognito tab because I already have some Google accounts set up and I don't want to cross those over. You're going to need to take some time to fill this out, name, your username. The nice part is if you take something, I'm going to take something specifically that's already used, it's going to tell you that that username is in use and will give you some options and you can change till you have it. You're going to create a password. Please remember eight characters strongly recommend using a mixture of upper and lowercase numbers and characters to make a nice secure password. Birthday, gender, mobile phone. The reason they ask for this, if you click and it tells you it helps keep your account secure, it's also a great way if somehow you're locked out, they can send a message to verify that it's really you. Current email address will give them another email address to tie your account into. And of course, they want you to prove that you are who you say. And you, of course, have to do the terms of service and privacy policy, which you can read and then check the box. So I've already set one up here with password and all that information. And so I'm going to go ahead and hit next step. And it's going to give you the chance to make things better for everybody through Google+. You can choose to set that up now, or you can say no thanks and do it later. You can also add a photo. And so for now, I'm going to say no thanks. Once you have that new email address, you now have access to all of your different Google apps, all tied into that. Um, they also will be kind enough to give you a quick little setup. Plus, you stays like this unless you set up your Google Plus account. If you set up your Google Plus account, then it will be Plus and whatever name you use for Google Plus when you are logged in. And that's it. It's very quick and easy to set up an account. Just remember you're supposed to be 13 or older to set up your own Google account.